A 13 year old Orange County boy is facing charges after he brought a gun and loaded magazine to school. He was caught on Monday at Jordan Intermediate School in Garden Grove. CBS 2 Orange County reporter Michelle Geely spoke with parents and some are frustrated by the way the school is handling this situation. Michelle. And Paul, parents want answers as to why this eighth grader brought that gun and bullets to his campus on the first anniversary of the Boston Marathon bombing. We are learning today that a total of five boys have now been removed from this campus. It's all about covering it up, covering it up. Tell us parents the truth. The mother of a Jordan Intermediate School eighth grader is furious that administrators on our daughter's Garden Grove campus didn't notify parents immediately after this semi automatic gun was discovered Monday morning in a student's backpack. Well, the problem that I have, it was on the anniversary of the Boston Marathon. What was the real plot? Were they going to outdo the news? Nobody will tell anything. I've talked to the principal. Us parents aren't just getting no information. This is the gun that the student actually had in his backpack and then the magazine that he had in his pants pocket. Garden Grove police confirmed that a 38 caliber handgun and a loaded magazine were seized from a 13 year old boy on campus Monday. The magazine with at least seven bullets in it was discovered in the boy's pocket. He was arrested. Four other boys with knowledge of the gun have been removed from campus as well. An unregistered Ruger rifle was taken from the child's home by detectives, according to officials. Authorities aren't saying why the eighth grader brought the weapon to school or whether he had plans to use it. There was no active assault occurring at the time. It was a report that a student possibly had a handgun in his backpack. It was not out at the time or brandished to anybody. Um, it was merely in his possession. And we went down and checked on it and did find that it was, in fact, true. One of the five boys allegedly connected to the incident was pulled out of Natalie Pritchard's class by officers. The vice principal brought the police in and they came over to him and they asked him what his name was and he said his name and then and then they took his stuff and then they walked him out. Now four of the boys who saw this gun allegedly here at school on Monday but did not report it will not be coming back to this campus according to police and school officials. Neither will the boy who allegedly brought the gun and the loaded magazine from home. He is currently in juvenile hall awaiting criminal charges. Live in Garden Grove, I'm Michelle Geely. Back to you.